Hey guys, Moto USA is out testing the new pre-mixers from Yamaha. This is the YZ250 two-stroke and the YZ125. All right, so you're not gonna see one of these bikes on the starting gate of an AMA Supercross, but the YZ125 is very important for one particular reason. It's the stepping stone bike. Yamaha knows it's a big gap from the YZ85 to the YZ250F. A lot of riders can't make that safely, so this bike, not only is it a really fun bike to ride, but it's an important learning tool for youth riders or amateur riders looking to step up through the ranks. New exhaust for 2011, updated jetting to make it run perfectly, and it's just a ton of fun to ride, so let's go do it. What's up, everybody? We're here at Milestone testing the 2011 YZ125 and YZ250. Uh, the 125 is absolutely a blast. You can't, you couldn't have more fun on a dirt bike. Still really responsive, still, still just like uh, the old two strokes, but uh, has a little bit of new ergonomics and suspension components are great. Super fast, clutch is responsive. Thing revs really well and actually pulls really hard for a two stroke. Basically, we've only been here like half the day. We're still gonna do some more riding, and I'm already sick of hearing the word fun. Fun, 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 fun. Capital F for fun. If one more journalist comes off the track and says that like you can't have that much fun, I'm gonna kick them. Fun, but they're not lying. The YZ125. That's really all it is. A three-letter word. Yamaha's really smart with this bike because they have a good market share. Well, it's because they're the only ones. Like, they're the only ones in the game. No other Japanese manufacturers are even bringing these bikes to the United States. People have gotten away from two strokes so much. You know, our test riders say it. I've said I haven't ridden one in so long. When you get back on it, you're just like, oh my God, it's just epiphany. So it's been a while. I haven't ridden a two stroke in five years. I forgot how to corner. I was jumping with front wheel high, messing up everything. It's just, uh, it's just awesome that Yamaha's still sticking behind the, the two stroke. As far as the 125 is concerned, it's an excellent bike. This bike is got great suspension on it. I think the suspension on the 125 is better than on the 250. The motor just shreds all the time. The handling is unbelievable. It was an absolute blast to uh, go and just rip corners and be able to flow into some of the ruts without that compression braking. The whole bike tracked well for the settings that we had. It's a hero bike, and it is. It's just fun.